let us write an algorithm to find the roots of a quadratic equation so we want to to find roots of a quadratic equation so this is a uh, the task given to us now the question is what is a quadratic equation a quadratic equation is uh, an equation that will be in the form of ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0 so ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0 this is called a quadratic equation uh, now if you know a b c values you can uh, write the equation something like this for example i am taking a value here let me take a value i am taking a value uh, suppose 2 and uh, b value i am taking as a 5 and the c value is a minus a 3 so like this i am taking these uh, values then now uh, the quadratic equation will be something like this you substitute this a value 2 here in this equation a value 2 then 2x uh, square 2x square plus b value 5 you substitute 5x plus c value minus 3 you substitute so here you will have minus 3 is equal to 0 so here 2x square plus 5x minus 3 is equal to 0 uh, this is your uh, quadratic equation now when an equation is given like this you have to solve x values in the quadratic equation x will have two values those two values are called roots of quadratic equation roots of quadratic equation so how can i uh, how can i get the roots of quadratic equation say i can write something like this uh, the first root suppose I am taking R1 is equal to root 1 is equal to minus B uh, and uh, plus R minus of course uh, R1 R2 both the roots I am showing here R1 R2 is equal to minus B plus R minus square root of D and this uh, minus b plus r minus square root of d divided by 2a that means what are these two roots first root is minus b plus square root of d by 2a second root is minus b minus square root of d by 2a of course what is this d so d is called discriminant so discriminant is calculated something like this discriminant d is equal to b square minus 4ac this is called discriminant discriminant tells about the nature of the roots whether the roots are equal unequal whether the roots are real or imaginary uh, roots are there uh, etc information you can get uh, from the discriminant so that you can calculate by b square minus 4ac so this is our uh, concept here so to solve the roots of quadratic equation what is the logic this logic we want to develop now 
so our algorithm first step is start the second step is first we have to input a b c values when you are giving a value 2 b value 5 c value minus 3 your equation will look like this 2x square plus 5x minus 3 is equal to 0 so a b c values uh, uh, we have to provide as an input so i can take uh, input uh, values for a comma b comma c in the quadratic equation now the, in the third step we will calculate discriminant so i can write uh, calculate discriminant is equal to discriminant is uh, this discriminant we are calling d is equal to this d is nothing but b square minus 4ac so i can write uh, b square means b star b minus 4ac 4 into a into c so please remember in computers you don't have b to the power of 2 for uh, representing b square if you want to represent b square b into b this is the proper way so that is the reason i am writing b square like this minus 4ac so this is a discriminant after calculating the discriminant d value you are now ready to calculate the roots separately so let me calculate root 1 is equal to first root i am calculating so root 1 is equal to minus of b plus square root square root i can write sqrt function to calculate square root value so square root of d divided by 2a that means 2 star a star is for into so this is uh, our first uh, root and uh, let me calculate uh, the next root so calculate root 2 is equal to minus b minus sqrt of d divided by 2 into a so please observe that the roots are given as minus b plus r minus square root of d so plus r minus means with plus one root will be there with minus another root you can calculate this d discriminant value is substituted in this place of d here so these are the formula root 1 and root 2 you have calculated then in the last step you can display print root 1 value and root 2 values we have to display and finally you can stop or end your algorithm so this is the algorithm to find roots of a quadratic equation. Now let us convert this algorithm into a Python program. Now this is what we are doing. I am opening my Python guy IDLE and here your file new file you have to open a new page where you can type your uh, program so let me type the program here this is a comment line comment line here i am writing the aim of my program to find the uh, roots of a quadratic uh, equation which is in the form of ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0 so we want to find the roots for that quadratic equation now step number 2 i am taking input values for a b c so these three values i have to provide as a input so i am taking like this a is equal to integer of input of a is equal to 
So here what happens is this input function will display a is equal to this is a string. Please observe this single quotes. It will display a is equal to and wait for your a value. When you enter a value, I am taking integer of course. That integer number is stored into a. Similarly, b is equal to int of input of b is equal to c is equal to int of uh, input of c is equal to so a b c these values you are providing from the keyboard after that you have to see step number 3 in the algorithm is calculate the discriminant that is a d value we want to calculate so d is equal to b square minus 4ac so 4 into a into c so you have calculated discriminant the next step is you have to calculate root 1 and root 2 but in calculating root 1 and root 2 we can use sqrt function so first let me import math module a module is a python program that contains some functions or classes you can reuse those functions or classes in any program by importing the module so here i am writing importer math so what is this math math is the module name or it is a python program written by python.org people and in this math program, you are having a SQRT function. That SQRT function I want to use. So first I should import math. Then let me calculate root 1. Root 1 is equal to minus b plus math dot SQRT of d. Why I am writing like this is math is a module. In that module, SQRT function is there. That SQRT function I am calling and using so math.sqrt of d divided by uh, 2a that means 2 star a i have to use similarly i want to calculate uh, root to 2 so i can uh, write uh, root to 2 is equal to minus b minus math dot sqrt of d by 2a yeah this is the way i have to calculate uh, root 2 then uh, calculation part is also over now you are ready to display your uh, output or results so print root 1 is equal to comma root 1 so please remember here you are displaying uh, a string that means this is this will be displayed as it is root 1 is equal to but here this root 1 is a variable so in this root 1 variable whatever value is already calculated value is there that value will be displayed here in this root 1 in this place so similarly print root 2 is equal to comma root 2 so root 1 and root 2 values I am displaying here. So with this my program is completed. Now let me save this program. Uh, this is a roots of quadratic equation. So I can save it as a roots dot py. So let me type the file name as roots. Save as type python files. So this program is saved as roots dot py. I am saving it is in, in uh, e drive click on save now run run module when I run this program it will ask me enter a value suppose I am taking a value 2 b value 5 c value minus 3 when I enter like this it means I am entering a quadratic equation that is a 2x square plus 5x minus 3 is equal to 0. I am asking the program to give me the roots of this quadratic equation. You press enter button. You can see the roots. Root 1 is equal to minus 3. 
root 2 is equal to 0 0.5. So, these are the two roots of this quadratic equation.